hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is Geraldine from Nanji style in today's video i'm going to do the struggles of poly gel part two i'm going to apply the gel directly on my nail and uh work with my brush through until it gets the shape i want so stay tuned and watch to the end to see how i get solutions to my struggles before i dive in into applying the poly gel i just want to show you how i Applied my false nail using this new products I bought on AliExpress the gel glue and the little UV lamp that I'm gonna use to flash over my nail to dry the nail, the false nail. Uh, I bought the flash lamp, the flash light for those who know it, but it didn't work. I don't know why I put the battery and everything but it still wouldn't work so I was obliged to use this one so I applied the gel on the nail the gel polish on the nail as you can see then uh, I take the false nail position it to my nail then uh, pass the lead lamp over the nail to dry it it's so easy and fast so i went ahead and did the same thing on both 10 fingers after i did on 10 fingers i just went around applying the gel all over the nails to make sure it's really like glued to my nail so i just applied the gel all over my nails on all 10 nails then i dry it all over then i went ahead and cut to the desired shape i'm gonna save you all these details and just watch through until I get to applying the poly gel.
All right, let's dive in into applying a poly gel, a gel on the nail. As I said in the beginning, I'm applying the gel straight on the nail. And I'm going to go ahead and use my big brush and slit solution to just push the gel around, push the gel around. Guys, we're looking for solutions to so this nail foam that don't stay on the nail while you dry under the UV lamp because I had this struggle for a long time. So I'm still looking for solutions. So this is another solution I found that I'm sharing with you. So you just play with the big brush, the acrylic brush. Lay it down, push the gel, spread the gel around to fill the entire nail. You could cut out the excess as you see me do. Guys, it's not always going to be perfect. You, you don't always have the exact measurement, so be ready to do all of this. And I'm using a little brush that comes in, in the poly gel kit to just like clean around my cortical area and uh, take out the excess gel that's built up under my nail. So you need this little brush like, to do the rest of the job because the big brush don't do it all. So I'm just going to go ahead and play around. It might take time. Just keep doing, then you cure it.
All right, I went ahead and did the same thing on all the 10 nails. As you can see, I applied a gel on the nail, straight on the nail, and I'm using my big acrylic brush to just play around, pushing in and pressing it softly to spread over the nail, fill the entire nail. Excuse me, guys. In the beginning, I kept saying my nails, my nails. I'm used to doing my own nails. I'm doing my sister nails this time. So after I use a big brush, I'm going to go ahead, take the little brush and just clean around my cortical area, clean around, push the nail at the bottom of the nail form, like make sure I don't have gel under my nail. So I'm just cleaning around with a little brush that comes in in a poly gel set. I hope this video helped a lot of people because this nail form don't stay when you want to put it under the uv lamp so we have to get solutions to these struggles so i did everything on the 10 fingers and going ahead to fire around and clean my nails and apply the top gel so i hope you did enjoy and learn from this just watch to the end and see how i finish the process and make sure you hit the like button if this helped you out and um try it and let me know why, how you did it
guys it's the same process that i'm using after frying down i wash my i wash my hands or she wash her hands just bear with me with the eye eye because i'm not doing my nails and doing someone else's nail wash the nails and clean out all the excess products and uh, dry it out apply the top coat for an extra shine guys please make sure you try this out just something to note is that when you are applying the gel straight on your nails and you use the brush with the slit solution you should know it's not really gonna dry out like you use the nail foam but no worries when you once you file down put the top gel it comes back to normal it might look sticky or not really dry but that's not really a problem so hope you enjoyed and learned from this video love you guys hit the like button subscribe if you're not subscribed yet for more solutions to our struggles bye bye